It's not about making a product, it's about making something so special for the future. It's timeless, it's going to go on forever, but uh, you've got to be the guardian of that and take it on. In a world of mass production, I think that everybody feels like something's being taken from them. And so they seek products that are authentically crafted by artisans. When they touch and feel the product, feel that there is something truly special because there's an artisan that actually created this product. One of the fantastic things for me is the Roll family get involved in the business. We share uh, exactly the same ideas and the same um, ethics and, um, and ideology. So we, we went out and, um, and established the business and set it as a solid platform. There's something I think intrinsic that, that goes to what makes Perrin and Row truly special. Uh, the craftsmanship, the heritage, I think that the people love this product because it, it speaks to an inner beauty within all of us. They were focusing on authentically crafted or authentically designed English tapware faucets, but using 21st century technology. But they truly wanted to create a collection that was not only timeless, but rivaled the very best products made in the world. Yes, we've moved on massively in terms of technology. We have better systems, we have all those controls. But the one thing I always wanted to maintain and managed to hold on to was this family atmosphere that we're all in it together and we're all going to make it successful together. And um, people on the factory floor are now realising that. Um, we have a number of people that are unique in the industry now. They're the last people left and we've got to nurture them, bring them on, look after them and, uh, and find uh, uh, support for them in the future. Uh, Tamworth, our sanitary facility, have a young lady that works there called Lisa. Um, she's probably the last one in the industry that understands how to take raw pottery in its green clay state and turn it into a perfect product ready for um, firing. And uh, that's uh, an art that is so special and so underrated in the industry, but um, is totally unique. I think intrinsic or understanding, it's almost, it's almost genetically uh, expressed in, in, these, uh, in these artisans, where generations upon generations have you know, worked with these materials and understand it, have a deep understanding of it. If I go to our Wolverhampton plant in the Midlands, um, which is really the heart of heavy metal brassware industry, uh, iron ore brassware, and um, you can go into a casting plant, which is one of the few in our industry left. Um, people have been there since the beginning of the business, but also for many, many years before. So you've got um, grandfather uh, right the way around to the, um, the grandson now working in the industry. And um, I think if I pick on one particular person, uh, it would be Peter in the casting plant. Um, his brother works in the industry as well. So again, it's a family business. 
but they've been in it for 20 years plus and um, you can tell that they, they want to stay in the industry, they want to keep going in the industry. They would love their sons or daughters to come into the industry. So again, it's, it's just a nice experience to really understand that it means so much to uh, these guys and that they want the industry to continue. And just like we see in, in, in the finest watches manufactured in the world or some of the most beautiful jewelry, we see it in, the, in, in our products as well, in these products. If you send parts out somewhere else, they have to have a tolerance to work to and open those tolerances up. So when the product comes back together, it's never got that feel or fit or function. It just feels like something's been made as opposed to something's been crafted. And, and uh, we've ended up with something that's so special that Roll in America saw that, they understand it, they have the same passion as I do for UK manufacturing or for manufacturing generally and they want to keep that alive because nobody else is doing it. It's just so special to what we have. I think that there is almost, a, you know, to use a, a philosophical term, almost a self-actualization that occurs when people come in contact with, with Perrin Rowan and, and these products. And that uh, obviously has been our mission, is to find products, to seek products that deliver on this, this quality and this, and this, and this level. And truly um, contribute to this desire that, that people, people have to curate an environment that's special, that's unique, that's personal. It's like finding you know, a rare gemstone or uh, a historical art piece that maybe you thought didn't exist or if it did, it was very hard to find. So we found that in Parent in a Row, which is very exciting for us because we think that we're making, you know, we're able to introduce that to the world and say, hey, this still exists, it's out here, and you get to experience it and enjoy it.